start. This is the best bench I've gotten, and I think it's the biggest bang for the buck. It is, it feels higher quality than it has any reason to be at that price point. Um, I've seen others at that price point that feel a lot more janky, a little more low end. This one is great. Uh, it feels really solid. It has a lot of mass and it came fully assembled except for, I think there were about four steps, including things like putting these on um, and, you know, and removing a pin to unfold it and putting the grips on. I love that it has the grips on the lumbar piece. It does not fold below, the upper, upper lumbar part does not fold um, much below level. You can see it's almost on its last hole. It has one more hole to go, so it, it'll go slightly um, below level, but not much. Um, it does much better with incline. Uh, these, the action on these is so, is so good. I can almost do it while filming. Almost. <laughs> uh, well, promises, promises. No, it slides really easily, but once it's in, it really grips. It, there's no wobble. There's no play with this. Um, oops, I guess it's gonna, well, I can't do it while filming. But anyway, these lock in really well. The bolts and everything look, they're just really high quality. Uh, almost everything about this is perfect. It has wheels. It does fold. When it arrives, it full, it's completely folded. And I'll show you where the pin is because it wasn't completely obvious to me from the drawing, even though it's a decent drawing. I just couldn't figure it out. But there's a pin that comes in this thing that holds it all folded up. And the nice thing is you can then fold it back up for storage whenever you want to. Uh, I can't do it one-handed to show you, but that's where that pin is. And then the, once that pin is out, and this thing moves down, um, and once that pin is out, you um, stick it down here. Um, so it, everything was good about it with the exception of, oh geez, where was it? Oh yeah, putting these on. Putting these on. Uh, the Allen wrench that it provided was way too big, so you just need a smaller Allen wrench. Um, I don't know what the what the measurements are of it, but the one they gave me was infinitely too big. <laughs> so hopefully you have some Allen keys just lying around and you can use those. That's the only quibble I have, but not enough to deduct the star because this, this is a, a really great value. If I paid full price for this, I would feel I, like I really got a great bench. It feels almost gym quality to me. So yeah, pretty happy with this one.